Hey guys, today I'm going to be answering one of my most frequently asked questions, which is how I connect my stuff to my computer. So, at the end of this tutorial, what will happen is you'll just be able to start your stack map, and then the time will go on your computer, and then when you stop, the time will be right there, you won't have to type it in or anything, so it saves a lot of time, and I find that it's very convenient. So all you're going to need to do this is a stack map timer, uh, I assume that this works with Gen 4 timers, though I haven't tried it yet, so here's my stack map. You're going to need a 3.5 millimeter to 3.5 millimeter cable uh, like this if I can find it I'll try to leave a link in the description to buy it but I might not be able to so 3.5 millimeters on both ends cable and you're going to need a 3.5 millimeters to 2.5 millimeters adapter so it could look something like this I actually had to cut this one down because it didn't fit and the tip of this one broke off but you could have something like this but I prefer something more like this I think it's a little bit more flexible, easier to use. So all you do is you plug the adapter into one end of your cable and then you plug the other end of your cable into your computer. And you plug it in into the input section which is the same one that you would plug in a microphone. It's not the one you would plug in headphones, it's where you would plug in if you had an external microphone. And not all computers have this so if not, I'm sorry, I don't know, there's not really anything to do if you don't. Uh, and then you just plug the adapter right into your stack mount. And that's pretty easy. The setup's pretty easy. These cables are fairly inexpensive. And now, you go into CS Timer, and you click Option. And then you're going to go to the tab that says Timer. And then you're going to en change Entering entering in Times, and you're going to change that to Stack Mat. So now, you should start your Stack Mat, and it'll go up on your computer. So this is really convenient, saves a lot of time, and another cool thing is you can actually still have inspection. So what you do is click the Use WC Inspection, and in order to start inspection, all you do is tap your timer lightly so that the red dot comes up. It will start inspecting, and then when you're ready for yourself, just start it like normal. So I hope that helped a lot of you. I know that a lot of people have been asking me how I do this, so there you go. Thanks for watching. Bye.